you know, next elections. <laughs> All right, um, basically I'll break down a couple of uh, simple visuals that we apply when we play. Uh, the first visual would be the pancake twirl. Um, so do we have anyone who plays traditional? Traditional grip? Good, we're gonna start match grip. So, all right, so everyone go to your match grip, playing position. I apologize. All right. So, basically, you're gonna be just like this, right? You're gonna take your fulcrum, which is your thumb and your index finger, right? You're gonna remove your back three fingers, all right? So from here, you want the tip of the stick to go to the outside of the forearm, just like that, all right? So the motion of the stick would go out, in, close. So the only thing you're doing is just opening your hand and closing them, just like that. All right, so the faster you do it, the better it gets. All right, so what we'll do, we'll just do an eight count with the right hand. We'll go one, two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. And then we'll stop, do a little exercise. All right, everyone take your right hand, put it up in the air. Stay playing. Or you could do it upward. You know, it's something that you can apply if you have like a, a group of 16th notes. Just, you know, it's something like that. So it fills the space when your left, when your opposite hand is playing. So you could just throw that in there to add the visual effect. Um, all right. So now we're gonna try to go to traditional. I'm gonna go to the next step, which is the under over twirl. All right, just like that. All right, so um, for beginner traditional grip holders, um, what I like to do, I like to say, um, you know if you get to a faucet in the bathroom, you want to drink water out your hand, you do that, right? You'll place the stick between the webbing of your thumb, your index finger, you'll close that with the fulcrum, the index finger, and then I usually place the stick right on the cuticle of my ring finger, hold it up right here. That right there is your upward rotation with the stick. All you have to do is come straight down, all right? So a cup of water, Place the stick, bring it right down. All right, cool. So now that we're all traditional grip holders, uh, first thing we're gonna do, we're not gonna jump right into the twirl. What we're gonna do, we're just gonna get the basic momentum, the feel of it. So you want the tip of the stick to go under your forearm and then rotate it around, just like that. All right, just play with it a couple of times, see how it feels, just like that. <laughs> All right, and then now, so the secret to that is once you reach halfway, the only thing you're doing is opening your hand, just like that, like waving, and the stick naturally twirls after that. So you go under, and then you just open your, open your hand, and then it rotates, just like that. Awesome. So like the same way how you can apply the pancake. <laughs> Oh, that was a thumb twirl, I'll be breaking that down next. Um, <laughs> all right, so basically, so you have the basic match grip pan pancake twirls, and then now you have the traditional twirl, all right? So now what we're gonna do, we're gonna go through to the thumb, thumb spin, thumb roll, all right? A lot of people are very talented with balance and the weight of the stick, that you can do it multiple times, just like that, all right? Don't ask me to do it again, I may drop the stick. So um, I'll do it once. So the key, the key to this, only thing you're doing, snapping your finger and pointing. I don't like pointing at people, so I apologize if I offend you. So here you go, snap and point, just like that, all right? So first, just practice snapping and pointing, all right? Just like that, all right? So now the thing is, you don't want to snap so hard that you stick. Yeah. Perfect example, perfect example. You don't want to snap so hard that the stick loses control. So you want to make sure that you maintain the control of the stick and just do a light snap and point, all right? You don't want to raise your hand. You don't want to tilt your hand over to the left because then the stick is just going to follow, all right? So it's just like that, snap and point, all right? Cool, cool. All right, awesome. So that right there is the thumb roll, all right? And just remember that the stick rolls right on the bridge of your thumb, just like that, all right? So as long as you keep your hand and your arms still, you'll be A-OK, -okay, all right? So now the next thing I would like to break down would be the three-way spider trick. Uh, you can do it match grip. It's a three-step process where you go... Alright, 
that's a three-way spider.